So, what I would say to a bully as a parent or a teacher is um, that you know uh, you have a lot of strength and you have a lot of energy and there are so many um, ways in which you are an amazing person. Um, but there is this particular way that you are channelizing your energy and your you know um, all your your um, intelligence because it requires intelligence to bully it's it's not you know you can't do it without being clever or smart so you have all of these um, but you seem to be channelizing it to bully somebody and create a lot of unhappiness for that person or you forget about that person just think about yourself uh, if i was watching an interaction between two students where uh, one person was bullying the other i would I would think something about both those kids and for the one who is bullied I would uh, say okay poor, poor guy like you know he needs some help and the bully I would say what's wrong with this person you know I, I don't really want to be friends with this person because tomorrow he may turn against me and subject me to the same thing so you know our words and our actions are actually describing us rather than the person that we are describing uh, so they tell us uh, they tell the onlooker and they tell the world about what kind of a person you yourself are so i may say uh, you stupid fool and you idiot and all but that doesn't necessarily make me smart just calling a person idiot does not make me smart if i'm smart then i don't really have to shout from the rooftops i'm smart it will come out in my words and deeds and actions so people will know that i'm smart so being careful about the words that you're using with people uh, because it's a reflection of your own personality and uh, it's a good idea to start looking at that because now you may be in fifth sixth seventh eighth standard but these things become a habit and it kind of tends to continue and soon you'll be writing uh, applications to colleges for admissions and later on for jobs and guess what nowadays people are doing they are checking on everything they are looking at your uh, Facebook posts, they are looking at what kind of uh, you know, messages you have been sending and everything is there on the net, it never goes away, it's there. Even if it is not on the internet, if you are just bullying in the physical, you know, what you call the real world, uh, there itself there are ways to find out and people remember these things.